Mosaic Community Bike Shop opened just last September, and in that time, they've already changed lives here in downtown Spokane. We caught up with one of those people who have found a better path. This is one of my best bikes. <laughs> been working on it for the past four days and almost done. I mean, I'm a skateboarder, but I've been riding bikes for the past couple years. I've been stuck ever since. Can't let it go. Levi Corker was stuck somewhere else two years ago. I grew up here in Spokane, you know. And it wasn't an easy life. I had trouble growing up and all that stuff, so I had, you know, trouble with the law, and now it's getting my life back on track, and Doug's helped me a lot with it. And Doug is the shop manager. He's our resident bike mechanic as well. Doug opened the shop here with a staff of volunteers. Teaching them job skills, mentoring them, trying to help them uh, get into a better place in life. And now it's, I, I got a passion for it, you know. And I didn't know a lot of the stuff about bikes. And then after Doug came in, you know, I was out there. I learned how to tension bike, the tension changed. And like, actually a lot that I didn't even know. Levi's volunteered here at Mosaic for two years. He went from hanging out under I-90 at the skate park the city demolished, just waiting for trouble. And now I want to be able to own my own shop instead. And it's re I never thought it was going to be realis realistic until recently, you know, now it's like maybe I can actually make it to that, be able to own my own shop. A shop that includes bicycle and skateboard training in a safe, positive environment. Teach kids how to ride, you know, keep them out of, out of trouble. The kind Levi needed to turn his life around. When you're not busy and got nothing to do, you get bored and just like, hey, if somebody brings something around, you know, like, you, you ain't got nothing to do, you might as well do it, you know. Now, Levi works to avoid those friends and spend more time with the ones he's made here, working to change the future for those who feel they didn't have one at all. Reporting downtown, Casey Lund, KXLY 4 News. Well, actually...